Northwest Lost Sales. Good afternoon everyone, my name is Jack and I'm with Northwest Bus Sales. Today I'm going to be showing you a 2020 Chevrolet StarCraft All-Star. Now this thing is a peach, only 20,000 miles on it, 25 passengers, your model 2020 and I know that there's been a, quite a shortage of new-ish units and I am excited to show you this bus, let's check it out. All right, got uh, Eric behind the camera doing an okay job today. Uh, gonna show you under the hood here. This is powered by the Chevrolet Vortex, six liter V8 gasoline engine. Of course, a company with a automatic transmission. Chevrolet Vortex has been around for years. It's tried and true. And has more than enough power to move this bad boy. All right, uh, Eric's going to show you the front passenger side tire. Front tires are around 12, 30 seconds. A lot of life left on those, both of the fronts. Um, the rears are at about five, so they are getting a little on the low side. But, you know, if you want to get some new tires on it, just let us know and we can help you out with that. Give you a nice pan of underneath. All right, so coming on inside here, we have an electric operated bifold passenger entry door. Uh, Jur floor, gray flooring, yellow step nosing, and a grab rail coming on inside. Uh, standard flooring is black. Uh, the gray just kind of doesn't show dirt as much, easier to clean. Uh, and people tend to love that just a little bit more. So a good little feature there. <clears throat> All right. Coming on inside, I mean, it's a bus with 20,000 miles. There's not going to be a whole lot of infirmities to talk about. But uh, sitting in the cockpit area here, uh, your normal Chevy OEM dash here. We got cruise control right here. Believe it or not, they don't all come with that. Uh, Eric, if you can show them the uh, mileage there. 20,818 miles. This thing isn't even broken in yet. A lot of life left. Over here to the right, we got your climate controls for your driver, just like you'd see in your car, super easy to use, driver AC and heat. Uh, we have the Chevrolet OEM uh, AM FM stereo. Uh, as of this year, they don't have the CD anymore, but they did add an aux input, so you can plug in your phone. Um, in the back, this is your rear heater switch integrated into the OEM Chevrolet switch, which I love when they do that. Uh, when they integrate into the actual chassis, gives it a nice cleaner look. Uh, we got an outlet here for whatever you need, plug in a Keurig or something or whatever you want. And then we got some 12 volt plugs here. Up top here, we got your StarCraft panel, open and close the door, interior lights, super basic, very easy to use. No one can get too confused. Uh, and this is your rear air conditioning. We have your blower speed, and then we have your thermostat for the rear AC as well. Up here, Roscoe backup camera that is integrated into the uh, rear view mirror as well, which is standard on all StarCrafts now. So it's uh, just one extra feature to make it stand out. All right, uh, up top here, oh, we're gonna go over the driver's seat upholstery. Again, 20,000 miles, not a whole lot of wear and tear. Looks great in that. Uh, gonna show you the uh, electrical board here. This has the new Intermotive circuit board. Um, and you can reprogram that to do all sorts of things for your application. Very cool, very small, very easy to work on. People love those. All right, in the back here. So this does have upgraded seats. So if you're a bus guy, you know, generally speaking, these have the Friedman featherweights. These have been upgraded with Berkshire foams. So a lot more comfortable, a little more plush. Um, and you can see uh, it's got kind of like a, what would you call this, like a tweedish type of cover on that. Burlap sack. Burlap sack, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> Looks good. Uh, we got uh, lap belts on every seat going down, and this is a 25 passenger. 25 passenger shuttle, five in the rear here. Uh, up top, we have overhead parcel racks. Throw up some backpacks, bags, whatever. Enough storage for, you know, small belongings that people will bring on board. Uh, covered in the, uh, the ceiling sidewalls, those are covered with a gray padded vinyl, which is also a uh, extra option that definitely keeps road noise down, a little bit of insulation, doesn't make it as boomy in here when people are talking, uh, it also just looks good. Uh, dome lights, we got four of them in the bus, two on the driver, two on the passenger side, and those are above the racks there. And then in the rear, we have a ceiling mounted AC evaporator, this is uh, by Transair, keep it nice and cool. Uh, while we're in here, I do want to talk about the warranty on this. So this does still have its, uh, its warranty, and it looks like the, uh, the powertrain warranty is still valid until June of 2026. So this thing still has warranty on it. It's still covered, 
And then uh, the bumper to bumper warranty is until June of 2024. So, I mean, you're basically getting kind of all the amenities and, you know, awesome features of a new bus, but still used. So, pretty cool. All right, that'll do it for the inside. Let's check out the outside. <clears throat> all right, coming around the side here. Again, not a whole lot to talk about. These skirts aren't all banged up. They look great going down, all nice and straight. We got your normal tour style windows with the upper sliders, nice and tinted. Gives uh, the rider some privacy. Uh, Eric's going to show you the rear passenger side duels. Again, around 5.30 seconds. Those are getting a little on the low side. They still are DOT legal, but uh, if you want some new shoes on it, just let us know and we can get that handled. Eric's showing you the frame under there. Not a rusty bus by any means. Looking beautiful. All right, coming around the back, these corners tend to be where you'll see the most damage on these buses, people backing into stuff. Uh, we have a few minor, minor little scrapes back here, almost not even worth pointing out, but just do want to show you that, and then a little bit of a, some action right there. Come around the back, rear cap looks great, going to the driver's side corner, nothing really to point out here, looks great going up and down. Driver's side skirt's looking good as well, not all banged up, dented in, anything like that. This rail right here though does have some action right here. It's not on the actual skirt, but this piece of trim does right there. I'll show you that. Uh, Eric's going to show you the uh, rear driver's side duels. And another pan of underneath. <clears throat> Looking good. Beautiful cinematography work by Eric today. Yo, um, I my best. Uh, right here, we do have a driver's side running board. This just allows for an extra step coming on into the vehicle in case your driver has a little bit of an issue. I was doing an okay job. Uh, in case the uh, driver has a little issue, you know, getting up this clearance here to the top step. So a lot of people like that. Um, and last but not least, we have our front driver's side tire. Last thing I just want to restate as far as the warranty goes, powertrain warranty until June of 2026, bumper to bumper warranty until June of 2024, this thing's still under warranty coverage, great vehicle for anyone looking for something new in this world that's kind of hard to find anything like this. So we're really excited to have this on the lot and we do have a matching unit that's a Ford as well if you need to. Well thank you for watching this Northwest Bus Sales exclusive video tour. If you like this bus or any other buses in our lot, you can call us at 1-800-231-7099, visit us at nwbus.com, or email us sales at nwbus.com. Thank you for watching. Yeah.